guys welcome back to my channel i'm so excited to be back thank you guys for tuning in it is greatly appreciated as always i am back from my vacation i had an amazing time but i'm so happy to be back i miss you guys so so much um i went to miami and it was just a good time to get away and just enjoy my birthday and i had really, uh, so much fun so yes thank you for all the birthday wishes it's appreciated but we're back back in action ready to play and a lot has happened in the Matthews household over the last few months we're going to say because time is moving like Christmas is literally around the corner they're excelling well in their careers and they're just ready for you know the next big thing like they're ready for a baby they're ready so the adoption process has been a really long process and they finally found a baby they got a baby um it's not physically theirs just yet because they still have a few more things to get done but they actually found a family who's giving up a baby and well they don't really know the family they just found a family well through the adoption agency they don't know the parents of the baby but they do know that they have a baby and they're supposed to get the baby next week so they're super excited about that so they already done the nursery and everything but they're going to invite their parents over tonight after work and everybody going to wear their ugly sweaters they're going to have some tea just relax and like a warm dinner and just um tell their parents their family their friends the good news about the baby and um baby a because um baby a his name starts with an a like i said they had the name for a very long time they wanted a boy they're getting a boy and they definitely wanted a big family but they wanted a son first and the nursery is done y'all like i literally came in game and so let me just play out plan out a nursery right and i got so carried away i finished the entire nursery the closet the bathroom it's just super cute i cannot wait to show you guys i don't know if i should show you guys now or wait till the baby a comes let me show you guys that they have a few presents under the tree this is their tree it's super cute and then we took some um they had an ugly christmas sweater party at one of their um i think derek's office so they took these pictures and um they had more matching sweaters there so it was really fun everything down here is pretty much still the same nothing has changed i did add a picture on the staircase up there and I think that's it like only and I think only thing we did outside was um we added um y'all look at the snow it is so beautiful but only thing we added out here was a snowman a door reef and um a little floor rug give back into the holiday spirit so I'm super excited so right now Derek is up he's on almost time for work but he's up making some coffee because y'all know they love their coffee on a and it's perfect time to make some coffee he's making some coffee before work did the coffee oh shit damn i just showed y'all in my accident <laughs> so that the coffee machine just broke let's go ahead and replace it and um you like man is it time for work yet 55 minutes it's tr okay it's brewing now i think is it brewing uh i don't know if it's brewing now let's see what bryson is doing bryson is going to work today everybody is going to work um let's go ahead and he's going to work because they're going to invite the family over later let me just show you guys on a calendar really quickly so 
Um, yeah, they're gonna have the family come over today. Christmas is literally a week. Christmas Eve is literally a week from today, which is so crazy. But the day before Christmas, baby A comes home. Okay, so they're gonna invite guests over to meet the baby and everything like that. Um, they're gonna go to the adoption agency and pick up the baby and things like that. So they're super excited. I'm really happy for this journey for them because they really definitely deserve it. He's actually up here um, practicing his debate skill, but I'm actually gonna have him go ahead and change into his Christmas sweater and probably come down here and get some coffee as well. Come get you a cup of coffee. Is it not brewing? Reset. Did the coffee brew? Make it make sense. It didn't. But okay, come down here and um, kiss, do a family kiss. I think that'd be really, really cute. Y'all, the room is so adorable. I cannot wait for you guys to see it. Like, we might just actually show you guys when the family come over. Oh, we our bills are off. Oh, my goodness. That is so ghetto. Let's pay our bills really quickly. I had no idea. Our power is off, and we got all this money in the bank. Absolutely not. Let's go ahead and, um, how do we pay our bills? Oh, there it go. So, I'm not sure if we're going to go the science baby route, or we're just going to, we might just do that, have a science baby, because, might just do that. We're going to go ahead and um, pay our bills as well because we need our power on. He's like, babe, what happened to the... He's, I don't know. The electricity box went out. I don't know what's going on. He's like, hey, babe. You had a good night? Cause he's like, yeah, I'm about to be off to work in a minute. You know? He said, that's good, babe. That's good. He said, I just paid the bill so the power is back on. So he's going to go ahead and go to work. He's chatting with Derek. He's feeling confident. Missy Freshness feeling great. Century Heating. So hopefully they both, um, I didn't mean to pause that. Hopefully they both come home with a promotion because they both are excellent in their careers. So hopefully they come home with a promotion. But we're going to see. We're going to definitely see. They're looking nice and dapper. Y'all, I fixed this front door last time so you're able to go out this door. This um, step right here was too high so they couldn't get up there. That's why it wasn't allowing me to put it as a um, front door. But they are actually off to work. I want to have um, both of them work hard because we want some promotions today. I'm going to just skip through and I'll see you guys once they get home. Okay, guys, we're back. So I see something about looming layoff in the corner. I'm going to address that in a second. But y'all, we got a promotion. We're able to choose our branch for Derek. I kind of forgot which route I wanted Derek to go in, but let's just read both and let's just see which one seems like more of a Derek, I guess, goals or career or aspiration. So an investor, it takes simoleons to make simoleons. Optimize your investments through diligent research to try to turn piles of simoleons into even bigger piles of simoleons. Hmm. Should everyone be laid off and replaced by robots? Should the company logo be redone to include more llamas? These are the type of critical decisions you would make in should you would be making sure you choose to venture down the path of management by reading these personally i can see derek ben in the management of career and the reason why i say that because yes it's good to stack money on top of money and make simoleons and invest in like different like bitcoin and stuff like that but i think i see derek honestly doing the management one so we're going to go for management and it's less money, but it's still making a good amount of money. So we're going to go to management. So he's promoted to vice president. Oh my freaking goodness. Like, oh my goodness. Let's read this. Oh no. Alongside profit warnings and dire prediction of financial comedy, Derek finds that his job is at serious risk of layoffs. Might be that working hard helps Derek dodge the layoff bullet, but who knows? So we know Derek didn't get laid off because he's been promoted to vice president. Period. It's period on top, period on top of period like what vice president ah that is huge to be a black man and be this high up in the corporate ladder is absolutely amazing he has no charisma no logic whatsoever and i know that's a lie because he should have charisma and logic like why don't he you know what i'm saying like what charisma he should definitely have charisma and logic i definitely am going to cheat that because what and let's look at um, uh, Bryson's. So he's filling too many Sims from fear of crowded places. These are things are starting to get a little claustrophobic here. Bryson can only focus on my over matter for so long before he wants to leave to somewhere less crowded. 
Okay, mental fog. He's starting to feel woozy from his mental load. Maybe he should take a break or exercise some creative skills before it gets worse. So he feel like things are getting better. Like he's in a law career, so he's probably having like, but we're not going to worry about work because we have our family coming over to tell them some exciting news. Let's go ahead and, um, let's go ahead and cheer. Let's congratulate our man. Like our man, our man, our man. Like let's go ahead and, um, let's do some affection. Let's go ahead and. Uh, let's see what should we do let's do small talk let's go ahead and brighten his day like bae I'm we are going in separate directions where are y'all going you need some pepped up bismo that's what you need all right let's go ahead and let's chop it up with our boo right quick like I'm so proud of you bae like so thank terrific. you bae thank you so much like man you know I, I didn't think that you know they got a lot of knuckleheads in the office but to give me vice president that is a lot that says a lot like babe i'm so proud of you as well let's go ahead and hold hands it is a little bird outside and let's go ahead and caress his cheek like babe don't give up don't let the work be the best of you okay babe okay period he like ooh, don't start something won't be nothing he like i mean well the family not here yet so it's whatever so i'm gonna go ahead and have them go ahead and go ahead and boohoo right quick with your man little celebratory sex you know what i'm saying Y'all, I do not want to show y'all the nursery, but I wanted to show y'all something else. So, um, I do have, look at the little bass. Y'all, they are so ready to be parents. You know how when you have a newborn and they be attached to the bed? This is the kind of the goal I was going for. I think that's super cute. Um, like I said, I do want to show y'all the nursery. I might actually show y'all the nursery before the family comes over. So, we'll be surprised and they'll be surprised, I guess. But I wanted to go to the calendar and, like, um, plan an event. Um, let's go ahead and add an event really quickly. So get that out the way. It's not a baby shower because we didn't really, th our parents, well, let's just say our family knew about the adoption process, but, and they knew that we were working on the, um, right on the, um, nursery, but they had no idea about like the timeline as far as they didn't really tell them because they had a baby before, like a few, like a month or two ago and the family, decided to change their mind last minute so they kind of they kind of really broke them down and kind of discouraged them a little bit but they kept the nursery process going they kept they hired an interior decorator to do the nursery and after that they decided that you know what they're going to continue to work on the nursery and speak into existence and um not tell anybody so that's what they've been doing and as you can see their blessing is they have a baby so they want to share this an uh, intimate moment with their close family and friends so i think we should probably should it be i don't think it should be a baby shower i think that if they have a baby shower it's probably going to be maybe after the baby comes or closer to the when the baby comes but i think this should honestly be i wouldn't say a family reunion i'm gonna say a dinner party a di i'm gonna say a house party right a house party we are the host period all right, we're going to invite Cal, Ray, honestly, they all Matthews. They related somehow. Um, we can invite the adoption lady. Um, let's do Serenity. Let's do Jaleesa, George, Josh. We're going to invite everybody, you know, everybody coming. The whole gang is coming, okay? All right, everybody is coming. We don't need no entertainer. Let's do, we're going to do here. If we're going to do it, I guess about 8. I think 8 o'clock is a really good time to do it. So that is set. So they can go ahead and make magic do what they're going to do. They're going to go they're gonna do that thing. So I'm here for it. I'm, I'm definitely here for it. Like, go do what you got to do. Then they're going to probably shower. And they're going to make something. I feel like they're going to brew some tea. They're going to probably make something um, really good. But I guess I can go ahead and show y'all the nursery while they doing the do and by the time i done showing the nursery they should be done doing the do and then they can get ready and they can tidy up the house a bit like they got less than two hours before it starts um hopefully everybody comes in their christmas sweaters i might go and cast really quickly and change outfits as they come that might honestly take too long so but i don't know i do want everybody to have an ugly christmas sweater so we'll see but i'm about to show you guys the nursery really quickly because love is in the air okay 
So y'all, this is, so I was debating whether I wanted to put, cause you know, their room is right here. This first room is the bathroom. So we have this room, this room, and this room. We have three bedrooms, three other bedrooms. And I wasn't sure which room I wanted to use, but I ended up using the one straight across the hall from them, which is perfect because I think this is the only other room that has a bathroom inside the actual bedroom. Every room has a closet, of course, but this is the only other room that has a bathroom in there, I believe. So I was like, oh my God, I did all the decorating and it's the perfect room. So whoo, yeah, I'm so excited. All right, so this is the little man cave. It's super cute. So you go inside, right? You go inside and immediately in the walkway you have a little diaper caddy and you have this painter that says some days you just have to create your own sunshine and then you have this is their his closet so they have like um his clothes diapers wipes all that good stuff diaper bag all that stuff in there right here is the changing table so you have everything you need to sanitize or wipes all that good stuff you have stuff in the drawers as well as diapers and then right here is like a little cozy area you could put some i think about putting a newborn big newborn picture up there like a newborn photo shoot or something up there we also have little um throw blankets and pillows and stuff to go with the status of the room i love these paintings i got these paintings off the gallery i think i just typed in baby boy nursery or nursery painters or something like that and this came up i thought that this would be a really cute accent wall and it was kind of like the color scheme i was going for which i love that went right nicely fit nicely on the wall and um the crib it just, it just looks so cute and i did this color scheme bare because it just brings out the room like the aesthetic and right here is because they originally wanted to do a space room but i didn't want to do a space room so we put these incorporate these cute little um pictures they got from like marshals and things like that because you know they they ain't, they ain't cheap but they go if you had they have cute little stuff in those stores little nightlight you have like a little tree because there they there he is their christmas miracle so you have a little christmas tree in here some toys a little sound machine wipes diapers baby detergent all that good stuff his dresser and then right here is like a little reading nook where they can read to him bedtime stories you know put him to sleep things like that if that's sort a bookshelf and this says happy plays you are my sunshine and then you have a little diaper laundry basket and more picture frames to add more pictures to create more memories and then so let me show you guys the bathroom it's super cute like when i found out that this room had a bathroom i was like oh my god perfect time perfect perfect room so it's on bathtub his cute little rug and um toilet and little pictures that his um grandparents had brought for him not knowing that he's a boy and then um yeah it's super cute like i'm so in love with this room i feel like they're gonna fall in love with baby a I almost said his name oh my goodness let me just get out this room but it's just so cute right like i'm so in love it is i just can't wait like i feel like this baby boy is gonna be so loved and you know so i can't wait for the family to come over and finally view it so to actually get in two surprises that they actually get in that they actually are bringing a baby boy home and they're also going to see the nursery fully out so i'm super excited for that so i'm gonna go ahead and let them finish go ahead and doing that woohoo session get it all out their system they are getting a little bit hungry i'm actually gonna have both of them come and jump in the shower really quickly come take a thoughtful shower and then i want you to come take a go ahead take a not to take a steamy shower I, i'll get you flirty and all but it's um it's a. Uh, cold outside so we're going to come down here and we're going to turn on some holiday so with the holiday music we do need to get some wine i'll just open this bad boy up need to get some wine let's do some what the hell is trash nectar Ooh. um let's do some fruit nectar and let's do some apple nectar you can't go wrong with those two i'm actually going to have you uh, can we change the station? I mean, next. I mean, next song. All right, that's more like it. It's giving Christmas. Let's clean out spoiled food and then come down here and um. Let's cook something, some dinner really quickly. Let's do some. Hmm. We had chili last night for dinner. So it's Tuesday. We could do Taco Tuesday. Let's do some. Hmm. Let's do some pasta, some pasta primavera. I feel like pasta goes a long way in anyone's household. All right, get out. You're supposed to be taking a shower, buddy. Get up. 
Uh, he like, but I need him tired. I need some. I need some extra sleep. <laughs> All right, come in here and take a shower. Take a steamy shower really quickly. Go ahead and step on this. Um, yeah. So you can go take a shower. Let's go ahead and unlock this door. Um, I want him to change his outfit as well to his um ugly Christmas sweater. All right, he's making that. And I'm going to have you come down here and um, pour four servants of both. Okay, he changed his outfit. He like, he's ready. Perry, you got Christmas music playing and stuff. Like, it's nice. It's going to be cute. So he's making this. But he's feeling good. He's feeling completely satisfied. Sunny aspect. You is not in your Christmas sweater. Get it together. Um, change your outfit. I think they're gonna all change it to that party wear, actually, but... Um, go ahead and change into your Christmas sweater. Let's start. Okay, the party is about to begin. I don't even mean to make it a gold party, honestly, but I guess it's fine. Um, let's go ahead and change your outfit back. I really don't even, honestly, don't even care about, um, everybody else having their ugly sweaters on, like, but we're gonna have ours on, okay, period. Okay, everybody is coming, like, this is nice, come on in, come on in, everybody come on in, make yourself at home, everybody is here, uh-uh, absolutely not, the devil is a lie, if I don't like it, it's not rocking. Mm -mm. I got people presentable in this household, so he's they're social out and whatnot. Let's go ahead and um, let's light the tree, and let's go ahead and uh, let's turn off all lights. Let's light all candles. Wait, did the pop go out in here? Let's turn on this light. Turn on this light. Okay, the tree is on. We could turn on some of these lights. Go ahead and turn on this light. It's too dark. We could turn on this kitchen light, I guess. What a light at here. Turn on this light. Alright, this is cool. Uh, go use the bathroom. Why are you sitting there about to pee on yourself? I'm like, well, happy you guys all can make it. Make yourself at home. We do have something to want to tell you guys, but I got to use the bathroom right quick first because... I got to pee. Where's baby at? Oh, he right here chit-chatting. Let's come over here. Let me see. I forgot who's in his family. Y'all, it's been a minute since I played, so I forgot who was who. Uh, I think Cal is his brother. And then, um... Oh, this is grandma. This is grandma. Okay, come over and say hi to your grandma. Let's remember this wedding day. This is his baby brother. And I just think this is uh, Bryson's sister. And his mom and dad is in his. I think this is his mom. And then his dad is somewhere. So everybody's sitting there having a good time. Somebody found some chili. Everybody found biscuits and whatnot. Let's turn him on effects off sweaters. I'm going to get a picture. Where is your outfit? Please make it make sense. You will not be walking around like that in this house. Absolutely not. The devil is alive. Not with my grandmother in here. All right, let's get this picture. All right, we're going to have you form a group with your man. Let's go ahead and um, let's see. Actions form group. All right, so I'm going to have y'all go here together. Go here together. The bathroom light should be on so people can see when they put what they put in their tush. You know, that should be on at all times. This is nice though. Let's turn on this light, I guess. This light can come on. But everybody having a good old time. I'm gonna have you go here. Alright, everybody's enjoying the pasta, enjoying the wine and stuff. Have drinks. Alright, go ahead and, um, but he's feeling good. Feeling important. Okay. Alright, he's like, bae, 
bae. He's like, I'll be right back. He's like, bae, you ready to tell him the good news? He's like, I'm nervous, but I mean, you ready? He's like, yeah, bae, let's just go out there and do it. Let's go ahead and express fondness. Be like, bae, I know that this is hard for us, but our family is here. They came here for us, and it's time for us to tell them, like, it's time for us to tell them what's going on. Um, I gotta act like they telling something. I wouldn't go over here and have him can't practice saying, can you do something? Please, please. And go ahead and sing. I don't care what you do. But like, so we had someone to tell you guys, we actually found a baby. We actually have a baby coming. He about to sing. Like, like, but you always say when you get a little alcohol in you. But they said we wanted to let you guys know that we are actually have found. Oh, this is a cute picture, too. Let me get this picture right quick. Family all in one roof. So, guys, we wanted to bring you guys here because we wanted to tell you guys that we are actually, me and Bryce, and are actually having a baby, guys. We actually, the adoption agency, agency found another family, and this time the family is doesn't want anything to do with the baby and it's a boy you guys know we wanted a boy the original family we had before that let us down was a girl and you know we believe that everything happens for a reason and they gave us a call two weeks ago saying that we have a baby and we'll be parents very very soon and when i mean soon i mean this time next week we will have a baby they're like what oh my goodness so much mother just thank you so much Thank you so much. So happy. That's what I like to see. Can y'all finish hugging for me? Oh. Aw. Aw. Too cute. Too freaking cute. Aw. I get all these moments. I want y'all to hug again because I missed it. <laughs> I missed it. Okay. Let's give her uh, another hug. Friendly. Small talk. Uh, let's do affection. Let's do another hug. It's like, thank you so much. I think this is um, Bryson's. Oh, is this his mom? Somebody got mom, somebody got grandparents. She's like, I'm so happy for you guys. She's just generally happy for him, and I love that for him. I just want them to come over here and grab a drink. I think Bryson was hungry. Come eat this pasta. And I think I'm actually going to start forming some groups so they can see the nurseries. The most about family LPs is like the coming together, you know, the interactions with the family naturally in the game. Like, I think that's one aspect I really love about it. Like, if, you, if you're if you really a family member, like, you're going to have a real reaction, like a family reaction in the game. And I love that. But we're about to go upstairs and see the nurse. Like, everybody come up here. And like, oh my God, it was like, oh my God. So, are we up here? Are, are we up here? Is everybody's coming? Look, they lit. Y'all is lit. Everybody, the family is here. Like they came, they, they came not to play. I love that. Like, come on. Like, well, thank you guys for, let make sure everybody get up the steps at least. So we want to thank you guys for, this is his nursery and we're so excited to, um, share this with you guys so just they're like wow this is beautiful already let's get this picture <laughs> i'm so excited they're gonna be great parents so he's like well come on in so beautiful like yes everybody come on in fit on in if you can they're like oh my god y'all this is so beautiful they're like yes we had a um y'all know we had an interior designer come in and they're like wow this is absolutely beautiful. Like what? Like so beautiful. Like, I'm so happy for you. She's like, I'm about to cry. I'm really getting emotional. Like, don't worry about washing dishes just yet. Let's go ahead and um, let's let's um, they're just so happy. Uh, let's go ahead and um, can we hug? Romance, uh, affection. Okay. Okay, they can't hug because it's going to be more than that. Okay. But you hug your own sister. Yep, hug lovingly. 
And like, I'm so happy for you guys. Oh my God, so happy. This is somebody's dad. We're gonna just um, congratulate on new job, but everybody absolutely loved the room. They said it's so beautiful. Like, wow. Like, this is, they said this baby is gonna be truly loved. So, it's just, I know I talk about you a lot, bro, but I really am happy for you, like, for real. Like, I'm so happy for you. She's like, I'm about to cry. Oh, you like, don't cry. She's like, I really am. I really am. Just, oh, the party was at least, you'll find a consolation prize of gently used book in your Sims inventory. But anyway, she's like, I just really want to just say how proud of her am I. You like, she's like, I know, you know, we grew up without mom and dad, but she's like, I really am proud of you. Like, the man you've become. You're going to make a great father. She's like, thank you, sis. Thank you so much. So everybody is actually leaving. The party I felt was a huge success. All right, who put this plate in my uh, child's room? Don't play with my child. <laughs> Don't play with our child. Y'all, I can't wait for y'all to see his name. Let's go ahead and make sure your mom's okay. Let's, um, let's go ahead and hug one more time. Make sure she's okay. I think this is his mom. And if I'm wrong, that's going to be crazy as hell. Let's look at the family tree right quick. Because y'all know it's been a minute. So, this is his brother. Yep, I thought that was his mom, his mother, and his father. And then, um, this is his brother. I was right. And then, this is, uh, oh, he want to say bye to his dad. And then, um... This is his sister. Oh, I didn't make his, I thought, oh, I made his grandparents. I don't know why it's not showing as his grandparents, but it's like, you're gonna be a great father. Like, thanks, sis. So he's coming up here to see. Okay, people still around having a good old time. He's talking to his dad. Let's go ahead and hug his dad as well. His dad gonna congratulate him, son. Like, I'm just so proud of you. I mean, this is his mom, not his dad. So this is mom and dad. This is so cute. I love this. I love this. I love this so much. We could have took some little cute little photos, but she like, this is really a blessing. Like, really a blessing. It's like, babe, I'm so proud of you. Like, so proud. Look, everybody just doing their own thing. He got to use the bathroom. He's going to hug his dad really quickly. Oh, he's like, man, congrats, congrats, son, congrats. Like, thank you, Dad. Oh, I love this for him. He really has to use the bathroom, so go make that happen. Let's put this wine up. We don't waste no wine in this house, okay? Okay, so he's going to go pee. Where's Bryson? He's upstairs. He's just taking it all. He's going to come down here and put this away. Go ahead, clean up a bit. Let's go ahead and, um, I think we go ahead and disband the groups, honestly. Actions, disband groups. Y'all can go home if y'all want. You don't have to. But I thank you, Father. He's like, I'm so proud. He's like, I'm so proud of you and Bryce. You know, son, it took me a long time to understand you and what you love. But now that I'm got a better understanding and I see you happy, man, I'm just so proud of you. Man, it's like a real heart to heart for him and his dad. I really love it because they had a rocky relationship with him coming out the closet to him wanting to be with men to him just his whole career path. And he's just so proud of his son. So I'm happy for him. I'm really am. Go ahead. After you go, he used the bathroom. Did nobody drink these? Because somebody could drink these. Drink these, shit. I think this is old, but um, go ahead and drink this. He's like, ooh, I'm tired. All right, uh, let's go ahead and put the cleanest up. All right, everybody should be leaving pretty soon because soon I'm going to say you don't got to go home, but you got to get up on out of here, okay? Let's go put these in let's here. I think I told, um, but it really it happened. Like, that family was really genuinely happy for them, you know, and everybody had a good time. So let's go ahead and cut this music off, turn it off. Like, they're super excited. Uh, let's go ahead and um, put this in here. He's like, y'all can let yourself out, but I am going to bed. I am going to bed. I am tired. 
So go ahead and go to sleep. He like, I'm exhausted. Let's go ahead and turn the baby room light out, y'all. Let's go ahead and turn this off. All the lights, all lights. There you go. But you could light all candles, though. He like, I am going to bed, honey. It's like, you good? You need a ride share or anything? You want to take you home? Let's offer some career advice to um, Bryson's sister. Because she's been wanting to, you know, get into business. So, she's always asking him. He in his Christmas PJs. I know that's right. But, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Oh, I, it's everybody still here for me. Alright. It's time for y'all to go now. Like, go home. I love y'all. Love y'all so much. But we got to work in the AM, you know. I think I want to have them take, like, a little day trip. They do have a, um, their company gave them, like, a little, um, for like a weekend trip to like uh do um what is called jet skiing and whatnot so i think they're gonna take that opportunity to do that this weekend like a little mini vacay before like a mini vacay baby moon before the baby comes i think that'd be really really cool all right everybody is pretty much gone uh, let's go ahead and lock our door lock door for everyone but household members um, we had some clothes in this wash machine for a very long time. Are they still good? Let's go ahead and wash laundry. And we're going to go ahead and go to sleep ourselves. These floors are filthy. Let's vacuum them really quickly. And then we're going to go ahead and go to sleep. I think that was a really success. Like, he's feeling happy, extra nectar feeling, feeling a close connection, nicely decorated, feeling happy, like genuinely happy. Smooth sifting, sunny aspect, exhausted from low energy. Mental fog, sparkling clean surroundings, and host pride. It says, let's see, God want to pass out. To invite, to entertain, to charm, and to regale them. Hosts who succeeded at this may take many pride in a job well done. So they are both sleep guys. So I will see you guys in the a.m. Hey guys, good morning, and we are back. It is the next morning. As you guys can see, Bryson is up early because he was actually the first one to go to sleep. He's getting out of bed. He's about to go ahead and um, take care of his needs because they had so much fun last night, y'all. Like, so much fun. Like, oh my goodness. They had so much fun. I was like, their family had a good time. Their family got lit. They had good drinks. It was good vibes, and everybody was genuinely happy. And I just love it so much. So he's about to get him a drink of water, brush his teeth, all that good stuff. Have him come over here and um, go inside his closet and change his outfit. We're going to do this today. And we're going to come down here. And um, we really want some coffee. Like, some coffee really, really bad. Oh, we didn't like the tree last night. Oh, my goodness. We forgot to like the tree. Let's turn on. It could be turned on for a little bit. Like, let's turn on the tree, y'all. I love the tree. Jaleesa is calling us. Hey, Bryson, I've been thinking about getting to know Vanessa. I think you should go for it. Y'all, I love our tree so much. Let's come over here and brew us some coffee really quickly after we drink our water. Bae need to, she's like, Bae, get up. He's like, I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. I'm tired, but I'm up. Let's come in here and use the bathroom. Um, brush his teeth. And he's hungry, and he's still tired. I'm actually just going to go ahead and uh, make him happy. Like, they had a good night. Um, I'm going to go ahead and make Bryson happy as well. Because they had a really good night, and I don't want that to ruin the floor. He got dirty. There you go. Where are you going? Go grab a drink. Let's go ahead and uh, turn off tree, this light, because it's daylight now. Go ahead and put that in there. Derek, come get you a um, pot of coffee before work. Grab a drink. Oh, he don't stop working. So, oh, you see, I knew his, he had skills. I knew I wasn't tripping. Like what? So six. I see. I know. Some be going with the game. I'm like, I knew he had those skills already. 
All right, he drinking his coffee, and he gonna go to work. He like, good morning, babe. He like, man, I got a huge hangover, babe. He like, I know, man. Like, he is pounding. He like, yeah, come sit, come sit next to your bag. But they're feeling good. I made them both happy. Like, well, babe, I'm about to go ahead and head to work. I'll see you um this evening. Like, all right, babe. So he gonna head to work. I'm gonna have to actually go ahead and put this in the um trash. Uh, let's go ahead and work hard. Go ahead and put that away. And you're going to get ready for work. And they're going to have a good day. Like what? They're going to have a really good day. I love them so much. Alright, go ahead and um. And look, he's going to work feeling focused. Y'all know yesterday he came home and was just not feeling it. But he's going to have a good day. Make sure everything is off and all that good stuff. And we will see you guys because there's no ha shoes in the house. But we'll see you guys once um, they come back home. Yes, have a good day, Derek. Okay, gravel of uh, corruption. Bryson witnessed something that could implicate a former colleague in a corruption scandal. The colleague has been appointed to a prominent judgeship, granting them the power to change the lives for better or worse of each person who stands before them. Should Bryson come forward with evidence that surely damaged his colleague's career, ignore what he saw. I'm going to say, should we reveal the judge? Mm, I'm going to say reveal. Notable newcomer, one star celebrity. Bryce has started down the path of stardom. His little days though, but that's, I guess that's part of the job. But he's a oh, burnt out. No, don't be burnt out. All right, take it easy. All right, we're going on vacation tomorrow, so don't even matter. Let's go ahead and take it easy. Don't be burnt out. Uh, all right, but he's home. He's feeling those things. We're going on vacation tomorrow. We're not going to work. So come and use the bathroom. Come use the bathroom. Let's go ahead and step on this dust bunny. We want to come in here and give us get us a bottle of nectar. Okay? Open this bad boy up. Drink that. It's about to expire anyway, so go ahead and drink that. Get up there. I don't want you to be burnt out. I don't like that for you. We're going on vacation, y'all. Like I said, they got a timeshare of a um, little getaway. So the next episode, they're actually going to, we're going to say Great Whip Large, okay? And they're going to replace this, and they're going to... um going to great with large and they're super excited even he's tense and stressed so we're going on vacation oh i'm super excited uh, let's go ahead and uh step on so let's say their flight leaves no they're going to drive the great with large they don't even need a flight they're going to drive there so they're going to pack tonight because i'm super excited it's like a little mini vacay before they get the new bundle of joy um i need to pack them they need to go in their winter clothes and get out like they're uh ski stuff because they're going skiing they're going they so excited so all right he is home what a day they're both feeling super tense so i'm gonna have you come in here and grab you let's come in here and because uh, we didn't have wash your hands oops i didn't mean that wash your hands and come grab you a bottle a server of nectar and yeah i think that'd be cool let's go ahead and get you a bottle of nectar Go ahead and drink you a cut a glass. I hear like, babe, I just need a vacation. So they're going to pack tonight. They're going to leave early in the morning. They're not going to work tomorrow. So, because how many vacation days do they have? Oh, uh, he's experiencing a burnout. Yeah, they're going on vacation. So he has three days. And let's see. Oh, they're both experiencing a burnt out, a burnout. So, um, three days. Okay, so we're going to go on vacation from Thursday to, I'm going to say they should go on vacation from a Thursday. Let's see. I'm going to say a Thursday through Saturday. And then they come back and get ready for the new baby. I think that'd be, that makes the most sense. So they're going to take a three-day trip. I'm super excited. That company gave it to them. And they also like take kind of like maternity leave as well because they um, are about to be parents for the first time. So he's going to grab his wine. Bryce just had his wine. Let's go ahead and dry this laundry. I'm going to have him come up here and take a nice bath.
bubble bath. All right, he's drinking his wine. He's going to just sit and relax. Just relax. Like, babe, I'm going to take a bubble bath. Like, I, I get it, babe. I totally get it. But, yeah, they would come up here and probably pull out their suitcases and whatnot. Go ahead. They should have more than one, actually. What the other one? All right, I'm going to have to go in. They should have more than one. I don't know where the other one is at. Is it back here? Nope. All right, I'm about to go and cast and get them another one. But that's easy. The floors are dirty. Everything is filthy. So it's not going to be a packed clean night. So they can make sure the house is all nice and clean. I'm actually going to have you come in here and um, use the bath because you're about to pee on yourself. Let's turn on all lights except for the baby room turn off this light turn off um turn off this light turn off this room let's go ahead and turn off this room all right so he's having fun playing in the bath throw this away once he get out i'm gonna have you come up here and uh, this is replaced what's wrong with the i don't understand these dryers clean lint tray set this laundry down it's always something he's super playful he's feeling good Alrighty, i'm glad he's having fun i'm so glad he's having fun i do want him to come and put up some christmas decorations as well too so i want you to come to the attic and let's do something for the eaves. Let's decorate or something. Um, this is cute. Uh, what should we do? Let's do that. Let's do some put some decorations up while we add it. He's feeling a little tense. He got to put this on the floor, ain't he? I knew he was. All right. He about to come in here and take a shower take a speedy shower I want you to vacuum around after that he's gonna go put something in the trash you have to go because we want to decorate the outside of this house before we do anything like we got a lot on our agenda the next couple of days so it's gonna be a busy night all right guys we're back he's taking off the trash and whatnot go put it in the trash he's gonna put some decorations up and boo just got off the shower I'm actually gonna have him come in here and Let's go ahead and pick up suitcase because the packing is real. He like, bae, I don't know where your suitcase at, but I got mine. So he's going to pack that bad boy up. I do want him to vacuum here. Do a little bit of vacuuming around and then vacuum down here. And then I'm going to have, he's taking trash out, putting up decorations. Once he's vacuumed, I want him to, um... Go ahead and add to washing machine, add some loads to the washing machine. Who was this? Oh, our sister was here. What's going on, sis? Why are you looking dirty? I don't like that for you, sis. I know you can do better. He's taking out trash from every damn room. Bubbles, central heating, feeling happy. We going on vacation, baby. All right, he's going to put those in there, and he's already packed up his suitcase. Going to vacuum this bad boy up. All right, he's going to come in and uh, wash laundry. And I think that's it. Like, they're just getting stuff done around the house, honestly. Let's step on this. When I say I'm so over these dust bunnies. Now he like, bae, I don't know where your suitcase at, but I got mine. <laughs> he like, bae, I don't know. I had it, but I don't know where it went. All right, so he like, man, whatever. I'm feeling good. He about to sit. Let's cut. Let's uh sit and uh let's watch a movie or something. He like, I don't know. I'm about to. He like, I'm a little hungry. Let's come over here and get like a little, get some leftovers or something. 
Did he even put up anything for the house? He did not. Why didn't it work? Y'all thought that was a bear over there for a second. I was about to say. I don't know why these decorations not working. Select Eric. Let's do. Let's do Eve. Let's do. What did I just have? Let's do these. And then let's do. Um, we just did that. Let's do the spin rails. And let's do the fence. What do we want on a fence? Mm. Let's do this one for the fence. And then let's do the foundation. Uh, I guess I'm going to do that and see how it come out. Let's see. I don't know why he's going this way to get to the day in front of the house, but I just want to see how the decoration is going to look. Oh, let's see, let's see, let's see. It's going to take a long time. Let's see. We have nothing but time. Let's see how long this going to take. Yes, yeah, a little baby moon vacation. It's going to be really nice. It's going to be really fun. I think. Okay, something came up. Oh, snowflakes. Okay. That's different. Oh, he's still working. Let's see what else pop up. Okay. I don't know what else came up. Oh, look at the lights. That is too cute. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. I don't like the... What's that? The spin rails? I don't like that. Let's do... Let's take the snowflakes off. Let's do that. And then... Let's do the eve over. Mm, let's do this. I absolutely love the uh the um like putting up these damn decorations as a full t oh that is too cute. I really like that a lot. Alright, thank you. That looks good. Let's come on here and look at it together. Let's go here. Let's go here. Like babe, this looks really good. Let's come out here and look at the decorations together. Oh, they like, babe, this turned out really cute. I like it. Uh, I like All right, this is really nice. He's like, this looks really good. He's like, it's really starting to look a lot like Christmas. So we're going to end this episode right here on this note. So let's go ahead and um, romance, physical intimacy. Let's do a, a nice little kiss. Period. We're like, babe. Uh-uh. Oh, you don't want to kiss your man? Don't do him like that. Uh, let's go ahead and romance. Physical intimacy. Let's go ahead and kiss. It's now or never. Period. Oh, Period. And y'all, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this episode right here, y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed as much as I did the next episode you guys they're gonna be in they're gonna be in with great wolf lodge and they're gonna have an amazing time like a mini work vacay I mean mini vacay away from work before the baby comes so it's gonna be like a mini vacay slash baby moon you know so I'm super excited y'all and I just can't wait so I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys in the next episode bye guys